transformation hero? Junban. Okay, I'm kidding. It's relining. But anyways, welcome back to another reading Cherry Hannah fan fictions. Also, I think I should probably say this. The live video in this video is actually being filmed the day after before than it's usually recorded. <laughs> this is a real weird concept for me. There we put this in the Lego straight. Oh well. I'm filming this on my laptop, so... Okay, now we should just continue on with the story. Today we will be reading chapters 57 and 58, so let's get started. <laughs> Chapter 57, Flashback 5 Toshi Shinzo's point of view. I was in the coming room with the rest of the class. Someone turned on the news and, I, the, and, and, and saw there was a battle going on. Then I saw Dad, Miss Midnight, Midoriya, Yuraka, Su, Su and, and Cherry. Hey, why are they there? says Zero. Then I see someone come up behind Cherry and stab her. She fell to the ground. To the floor, to the floor, to the ground something. Cherry, I yelled while jumping up from my seat. Shinzo, don't try to run to her. We don't know which hospital she will be going and and how safe the place is, I said Senyaida. Fine, I said sitting back down. The next day I couldn't get get out of my room room i was just thinking about cherry and dad then my phone started to ring it was dad dad are you all right is cherry all right this is how she i'm right i only need a few stitches and cherry is also all right you can come see her thank you i'm on my way all right see you later bye bye i hanged up got ready to to leave before i left i told Ida that i would be going to, to the going that i have permission to go I left and stopped by the store to get uh, things for Cherry and Dad. I was told that Cherry is in a room with your rock and Nisuyu, so I got them their stuff too. I got my dad a coffee because I knew he would need it. I got Cherry's flowers and some of her cherry flavor and some of her favorite cherry flavored candy. My dog is barking, so sorry. <laughs> I got your rocket. What on earth is Summer doing? Sorry, my dog again. I got your rocket and Suyu, Suyu, Mochi, and Jelly. Now I want some Mochi. What are they barking at? I paid for the stuff and left. When I got to the hospital, I bumped into Dad in the waiting room. You're finally here, said Dad. Yeah, I am. I said while giving him the coffee. Thanks. You will need to talk to the front desk to get to Cherry's room, said Dad. Thanks, I'll see you later. I said while waving at him. I walked up to the front desk and checked in, for I can see, go see Cherry. My dogs. I take her. I I, I take I will I, I will take her and take take you to her room. I uh, just realized I messed up. Said a familiar voice. I looked next to me and saw I need to Hannah, Cherry's mom. Oh, I forgot you work here. I said. Come on, Cherry's room is over here. Said Anita. Thank you, I said. No, no, thank you for coming to see Cherry, said Anita. It was hard because I needed to get permission first, I said. I understand, said Anita. We got to Cherry's room. I already got to see her and I have to get back to work. Just knock on the door, said Anita. Thank you. Have a good day, I said. You too, said Anita while walking away. I knocked on the door. Come in, said a voice. I recognized that voice. It's Cherry's. I opened the door. Hey, I said. Hey, Cherry said with a, Cherry, said Cher Cherry with a smile. I heard that you're sharing a room with your rock and Sue, so I brought some things for them. I said, I give give your rock and the, the mochi and Sue you the jelly. Thank you, said your rock and Sue at the same time. I give give cherry, cherry, cherry the flowers and cherry candy. Thanks, said Cherry. So this is a secret you couldn't tell me? I asked. Yes, I'm sorry, said Cherry. It's okay, I said. I stayed, stayed. A while for <laughs> stayed for a while, but had to leave because visiting hours were almost over. I gave Cherry a kiss and said goodbye. I left happy knowing that everyone's safe. Now let's move on to the next chapter, <laughs> chapter fifty-eight, flashback six. Midnight's point of view. Dang it, my dogs! We just got to the hospital and I I rushed with the paramedics to get Cherry some help. Then I hear someone saying, "Wait, is wait that's." That's on my cherry. What happened? Asked the lady. She looked like a nurse, and I saw her name tag. It, it, tag. it said Hannah on it. Excuse me, but are you by any chance Cherry's mother? I asked. Um, yes, I'm Anita Hannah. Said, said Anita. I'm the pro hero of midnight. I and also Cherry's uh, cher one of Cherry's heroes. And I think we should go somewhere to talk. I said. We walked 
to the more quieted, quieter place. So what happened, asked Anita? We were on a rescue mission to rescue a little girl, and Cherry was hold, holding her, then she, out of nowhere, she jumped out of Cherry's arms, and Cherry ran after her, and she told me to keep going because I was helping another student who was badly injured. But I, but because I didn't, didn't follow her, she got stabbed trying to get the little girl back, I said. She's just like her father said, said Anita. What do you mean by that? I asked. Cherry's father was a police officer and he would have done the same thing, said Anita. I know she will be a great hero and with your support, she will be a great, I said. Thank you. I should get back to work. I can throw you in about Cherry. Cherry later, uh, said Anita. Thank you, I said. Later that day, I saw Hitoshi Shinzo, Shinzo come into the hospital and I knew that he was Cherry. They didn't ch cherry, and I also know that he is Sh Shota's 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 son, son since I am his godmother. <laughs> I over I'm happy that my godson was visiting his girlfriend, Jerry. Okay, and that is it. It sorry, this is kind of itchy. And I hope you enjoyed this video and you're going to be seeing and oh don't forget just remember I just remembered the links to the fan fiction will be in the description below. Well that's all and you're going to be seeing some words in 3, 2, 1.